everyone, did you watch the big show? During this year's State of Unreal, we released Unreal Engine 5 with oodles of updates including a redesigned Unreal editor, better performance, artist-friendly animation tools, an extended mesh creation and editing toolset, improved path tracing, and so much more. See a complete list of changes at docs.unrealengine.com, then download it today on the Epic Games Launcher or GitHub. In addition to UE5 itself, you can now enjoy two new sample projects. Lyra Starter Game is a living sample gameplay project built alongside UE5 development to serve as an excellent starting point for creating new games, as well as a hands-on learning resource. And the brand new City Sample reveals how the scene from The Matrix Awakens, an Unreal 5 experience, was built and consists of a complete city with buildings, vehicles, and crowds of metahuman characters. Beyond the complete sample, the content is available in separate packs so you can download just the vehicles, for example. Snag both of the new sample projects from the UE Marketplace. We recognize we wouldn't be here today without the incredible Unreal community, and to help you on your dev journey, we've launched the Epic Developer Community, a one-stop shop to explore tutorials, learning resources, code snippets, technical discussions, and of course, ask questions. Head over to dev.epicgames.com community to join in. If you want to see the state of Unreal for yourself and hear all the juicy details firsthand, head to the Unreal Engine YouTube channel to watch the show on demand. While there, you'll also find the series of tech talks that were streamed after the event. In The Matrix Awakens Generating a World, we share how we procedurally generated the city for The Matrix Awakens an Unreal Engine 5 experience demo using a combination of Unreal Engine native procedural tools and a game-changing new Houdini workflow. In The Matrix Awakens Creating a World, we dive into the inspiration and approach behind the environment. Or dive into your first game in UE5, a practical in-editor demonstration of how to get started making a game from scratch, highlighting UE5 features along the way. We show how fast you can create a game leveraging new and established features of the engine. This week's first community spotlight is a wonderfully vibrant, stylized environment built in UE5 by Fabian Lopez Orosa. Breath of the Sky was a wholly self-created project, aside from a few VFX. If you adore this project as much as we do, head to their ArtStation page and let them know. Before you now is a gorgeous replica of the famous St. Paul Cathedral by Juan Pablo Fuentes Ruiz. Stroll on over to their ArtStation page to take in the sights and explore more of the scene. From solo dev Just Perky Games, The Access Unseen is a horror-hunting simulator where you chase down folklore-inspired monsters, but be careful, they're hunting you too. Learn more about the development over on the forums and wishlist The Access Unseen on Steam. Thanks for watching this week's news and community spotlight.